You know, it seems whenever I go around Oakland County, someone tells me they have worked, gone to school, or lived at some time in their life in the city of Clawson. So I'm pleased today to have Jennifer True talking to us today about a special event to help the Clawson High School Band. Thanks for being on the show today. Thank you for having me. Really now, appreciate it. Tell us about the Keeping in the Sea Town All Alumni Reunion. Well, this is an opportunity for uh, many of the folks, whether they've been to Clawson in the last you know, couple months, couple of years, maybe they were all um, at one point in time still live in Clawson, but this is a good opportunity for us to raise money for the Performing Arts Boosters. Okay. Um, and, and the event's going to be at the Knights of Columbus okay. on Saturday, October 13th, and okay. we're encouraging anybody that's somehow associated with Clawson to come out. Okay, and we have a flyer here. Mm -hmm. And what I find is interesting is we have two pictures on the flyer, one from 1992 and one from 2012 with the band. Can you tell us yep. a little bit about that? Well, actually, um, believe it or not, these the last time that the uniforms were purchased was back in 1989. Okay. And when I heard about that, um, I'm probably, like most of your viewers, were a little bit shocked <laughs> that uh, the uniforms are still being used. And um, I guess they don't make a, uh, I, I mean, as for the uniforms themselves, they've uh, held up for a long time. And, okay. you know, um, at this at this point in time, uh, as for the uniforms, they're about $230 a piece. They don't come very cheap. So right. uh, what we're doing is trying to raise over $20,000 for the night to help raise and replace those uniforms. Okay. And so uh, tell us a little bit about what's going to be going on at the Keep It in the Sea Town uh, mm -hmm. event here. Well, it's going to uh, start at 9 p.m. at the Knights of Columbus, and uh, for a $10 donation, you'll be able to uh, enter the Knights of Columbus Hall, enjoy some music, um, enjoy uh, the silent, uh, actually be able to uh, participate in the silent auction that we're going to have, okay. and uh, also we're going to have a nice little uh, small uh, Clawson merchandise booth over there as well. To okay. um, so you can want to buy some Clawson alumni gear, you'll be able to purchase that as well. Mm -hmm. And um, we're gonna have a cash bar, um, lots of music, lots of memories, lots of fun. So all right, great. Yeah. And that, again, that's on Saturday, October thirteenth. Mm -hmm. And how much is it at the door to get in? Ten dollar donation. Okay. And for those people who don't know where the Knights of Columbus Hall is, it's between. 14 and 15 mile road on Main Street? That is correct, okay. at uh, 870 uh, North Main Street. And if people want to make donations, maybe because they can't attend or they might want to give more than the donation at the door, uh, can they do that? And is there a name of a charitable organization or how does that work? Out? Absolutely. Uh, we're certainly looking for uh, donations, um, whether it be a monetary donation, uh, whether it be for services, you know, an actual item, would love uh, any sort of donations. Okay. So um, if they are interested, they can certainly call. Uh, phone number. Uh, actually, there's two different phone numbers. There's 248-376-2293 okay. or 248-891-5822. Okay. Uh, we also have an email as well, uh, if that's something easy for folks to connect okay. with us. That ad that email address is ClawsonHSReunion at okay. gmail.com. Okay. So, and yeah. uh, one more spot, actually, sure. uh, we are on Facebook. We do have a page, so if you type up Keeping It in Seatown, you'll be able to uh, find our event, and um, please uh, please attend. We're That's looking great. forward to it. And, you know, how did you first come about deciding to, to do the support for the band in regards to this as well? Well, actually, uh, last year there was a similar event that okay. uh, occurred at the Knights of Columbus okay. with a with the um, class of 1991, mm -hmm. and uh, they're also um, uh, getting donations, trying to raise money for for the class in public schools okay. with the bo boosters, and also for the uh, performing arts. So um, it was actually you no know, this year as uh, people were had approached, you no know, talked mm -hmm. about having a similar event. Um, that's how I got involved. I really like uh, the Clawson community. Uh, right. This the idea of helping each other out, and there's a lot of people, you know, in the background that uh, feel the same way. So, well, thank you for volunteering your time to do this as well. It uh, really helps make it a better community for all of us mm -hmm. there. So, if you're going to be in Clawson area on October 13th, stop by. And if you're a former alumni, or maybe you have fin friends or family that have uh, gone to Clawson schools. Stop by for a great time to help a great cause. Let's get some new uniforms for the kids so we can take pride in the Clawson Marching Band. Thanks for being on the show. Thank you. I really appreciate it.